So would you like to automate orders into CJ Dropshipping in a very easy way? All your orders completed guide. I'm going to show you how to do this in a very easy way. The very first thing you want to do is to sign up and log in into CJ Dropshipping. For that, you have the links down below in the description in order to get started. Once you have your CJ Dropshipping account created, you want to focus into your store. Into your store, I needed to connect my online store. Into the left part, I have the section that says authorizations. Here in this case, I'm going to choose the Shopify element for this tutorial. Inside here, you should see that we have a lot of stores, but in this case, I just want to focus into my actual store that I'm currently using. So for that, I'm going to locate my store. I'm going to sign into my store. And once I am signed directly into my store, I want to make sure here into the upper side that I have this code. This code starts with a six and ends with zero four. Once you have done this process, you can just go back directly in here Let's go into authorizations, once again, Shopify, and make sure that the code is now apparent from CJ Dropshipping into your store. So as you can see here, it is. Now that you have done this process, what you can do is to import products directly into your store. So to import products from CJ Dropshipping directly into your store, first of all, we're going to focus into the left part that says product. Here, I wanted to focus into products and browse select products you wanted to list into your store. So if I go and focus it into my products, here I can see all the products that I have added directly into CJ Dropshipping. If you wanted to add on a specific product and use this product so you can sell this directly into your Shopify store, let's say for example that you wanted to select this product. So I select this product and look out for list. Inside list, I choose my store selection, in this case ending with 204. Here I have the product typed, the title, the bundle, the tax, and the collections. So here into the collections, you can create a new collection. For example, let's go for sneakers and go for confirm. And I choose the sneakers, fashion, Lee, letter, casual, men. So I go for the variant pricing. In this case, I'm going to just leave this as a recommended list in price, just in case you don't know how to uh, sell this product and go for list it now. Now my product has now been listed from CJ directly into Shopify. Verify that directly into the love pod go for products and check out that your product has now been appearing here into the product section. As you can see here it is my product. So it actually looks really great. Now what I need to do is to set up the order syncing. So to set up this order syncing, what I need to do is to first of all in go back directly into CJ Dropshipping. Inside the CJ Dropshipping, what I can do now is to focus into my CJ and go for orders. So I'm going to close this, go for orders. And here, as you can see, we wanted to enable the syncing of the order. So inside the orders, I wanted to enable the option to automatically sync orders from the store CJ Grab Shipping. So here I go for store orders and here have imported number one. What I wanted to do is to make sure that my order has not been imported automatically. So for that, just focused into import orders or synced store orders. So here into all stores, choose the one that has the code of the current store you're currently using, sync it by time, and the start day, let's say for example, from yesterday till today, and go for sync now. And your product has now been imported automatically. Now to enable the automatic fulfillment for your orders, in the order section, I'm gonna close this, I can focus inside here and look out for fulfillment status. Inside fulfillment status, what I can do is to check out where are my order fulfillment here. If I have an order fulfillment already been added, automatically what I can do inside the order section is to make sure that I have enable the setting section and enable the automatic fulfillment. Here, usually should be appearing here into the upper side. In this case, since we don't have any product yet, I believe that we are not able to do this at the moment. Here is a close scheme about the automatic order directly here in CJ. So when we create the store authorization, we now have access to the store sourcing. So that means that once we have done the store authorization, we have done the product search, we have added the product directly. When they make a payment from Shopify, here's going to appear at my order. This order should be sent automatically here into CJ Dropshipping. And to fulfill the order should be done automatically when you sync your store here from CJ Dropshipping. And you have all the information here into orders. 
basically that's how we can actually do this process in a very easy way so guys with that being said we have not written to the very end of the video but don't forget to like share and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more amazing tools on how we can do this fulfillment using c drop shipping and so much more elements thank you guys so much for watching this video hopefully with that being said we can see you next time see you soon